Getting up close and personal, the colonoscopy offers almost unparalleled access to your large intestine or colon. In the average adult, it's about five feet long and three inches in diameter. We use a flexible tube that has a light and a camera, and we're able to see the lining of the colon. And basically, we're looking for polyps, which are uh, abnormal growths on the lining, and um, we can remove them, and this decreases the chances of getting colon cancer significantly. This is the view doctors see. They look for ulcers, tumors, areas of inflammation or bleeding, and most importantly, very specific polyps. The majority of the polyps are uh, not cancer. And we're basically looking for adenomatous polyps, which are the precancerous types. One of the most successful screeners ever, the colonoscopy detects, treats, and possibly eliminates the cancer threat. It's also underutilized. Many people who should get one don't. The usual recommendation is to start at, at 50. Mm -hmm. uh, but if there is family history of, of colon cancer or polyps, uh, uh, the recommendation is to do it sooner than that. Putting expert eyes on your insides makes a big difference. Colon cancer is one of the most common cancers in this country and uh, is the, uh, one of the leading causes of cancer death. So, but this doesn't have to be that way. Colonoscopy is a great form of prevention. That's the way doctors see it. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.